In this tutorial, we'll look at creating related and replacement orders using these two actions on the Action menu. To learn how to complete a manual order entry, go to wiki.sellercloud.com and click on Creating Orders. One benefit of a related order is to make it easier to take an order from a returning customer. Open any previous order by that customer. Open the Action menu and click Create Related Order. A new order will open with the returning customer's information. Add the ordered items and complete the order form. Another benefit of related orders is to show the relationship between two orders when shipping an item related to a previous order. Let's say the customer lost a part of a set. Creating a related order will show the relationship between the two orders by referencing it over here with a link attached. A replacement order recreates a previous order. This is useful when replacing a damaged or lost shipment or if the customer wants to reorder the same item. Open the order in question and select Create Replacement Order from the Action menu. Except for the shipping and payment info, the order will be recreated entirely. Payment will be discounted fully by default, so if the customer is simply reordering an item, you would need to adjust the discount and receive payment. Creating a replacement order is particularly important to keep inventory levels current. While unshipping an order and reshipping it would get the order out to the customer, the inventory level would not show a deduction in inventory. A replacement order, however, is a new order, so it uses a new item and deducts from the current inventory levels.